Well, he is a legislative giant, the longest serving congressional representative in our nation's history. And at times using his stature to his advantage. Yes. And now, after almost 60 years in Congress, Representative John Dingell will not be seeking reelection in November. John Dingell in Southgate today, and our Jim Kurtzner is there where Dingell expected to speak shortly. We're looking forward to hearing from him. Jim, good afternoon this to you. This is the Southern Wayne County Regional Chamber event. This luncheon just getting underway. This is the swan song for John Dingell, where he is expected to formally announce his retirement from Congress. He got a standing ovation when he walked here in here about 10 minutes ago. Some of the other politicians here say this retirement will not just be heard here in Metro Detroit, not just throughout Michigan and the United States, but around the world because he has been the longest serving member of Congress in U.S. history. He was first elected back in 1955 at the age of 29 years old, replacing his father who was in Congress for 20 years. He is the dean of the United States. About his career, ironically, last summer up at the Mackinac Island, conference with our political director Chuck Stokes. Take a listen. I've been able to stand on the shoulders of giants who've taken me in and helped me learn and I've had an opportunity to participate in discussions of really important matters and to make a contribution like saving the auto industry, getting the health care bill through, getting Medicare enacted, cleaning up the Great Lakes. Uh, passing a lot of wonderful conservation and consumer legislation, which I'm very proud. But remember, I'm a public servant, and I'm supposed to do that. And I'm supposed to do the best job I know how for my people. Again, we are out here live at the Southern Wayne County Regional Chamber in Southgate. People wishing the congressman well here. He was quoted this morning as saying he did not want to be carried out that uh, he Congress too long. He will turn 88 years old in July. He said his health is good right now, but he was also pretty frank when he said that he might not be able to carry out another full two year term. We are expecting his remarks here shortly, and we will bring them to you live. For now, I'm live in Southgate. Jim Kurtzner, 7 Action News. All right, looking forward to hearing from him. And of course, we'll be streaming live on WXYZ.com as well when he speaks. You know, he talked a little bit about some of his many accomplishments there with Chuck Stokes you heard just a second ago. But let's sum up some of these accomplishments for you. During his 59 years in office, Representative John Dingell has played a role in passing multiple pieces of landmark legislation. He fought every term for universal health coverage and sat next to President Obama when the Affordable Care Act was signed into law. He also helped pass Medicare under President Lyndon Johnson. Dingle also worked on the Civil Rights Act, the Endangered Species Act, and the Clean Air Act. He was also one of the biggest supporters of the auto industry. Dingle has been a representative for more than 21,000 days and has served with nearly 2,500 different congressional representatives. Lawmakers who have worked with Representative Dingell are weighing in on today's announcement. Senator Carl Levin, who is also retiring when his term finishes, said, quote, I have known no better person in government during my 35 years in Congress. Everyone who cares about Michigan has benefited from his tireless advocacy of our state. And even members from across the aisle giving their thoughts. Republican Representative Candace Miller saying, quote, John Dingell is simply a man who loves his community, his state, and his nation, and he served them all well. I am so proud to call him my friend.